I, in all actuality, do assume it is conceivable that on the second, there is one development inside the smooth house. Sacred wow! This is unbelievable! We will be learning a parcel inside the approaching ten years. Found seven trillion miles from Earth is an inconceivable revelation made through the James Net Telescope. City lights in the region. This incredible finding has lighted a solid wave of interest roughly the chance of extraterrestrial presence. The telescope focused on Proxima and Peak B, the nearest exoplanet to Earth, showing remarkable splendid lights radiating from it. What will be chargeable for these city lighting installations on Proxima and Torb? Could this mean the presence of life past our planet incorporate us? As we dive into how the James Webb Telescope distinguished these remarkable things in region throughout recent years, researchers and people in NORM have completed exploration to get a brief look at life past our sun. Contraption any evidence seemed to return up. This dream about face has been happily invited. During that time, as of late, the clinical network got the amazement of their lives at the point areas of strength for when of ways of life desk work current in region become found by the James Webb Region Telescope. Indeed, even as exploring space and transferring basic records got back to Earth, the James Net Space Telescope seen odd city lighting sparkling from the exoplanet Proxima Center B. Essentially as its name inferred, the city lighting seemed like they illuminated a distant city. The apport chance of an outsider town current on the whiz has left researchers pulling in surprise all sundry is bewildered on the grounds that it shows up like that is the ways of life they've all been looking for. In the event that this is by all accounts genuine as everybody suspects it will be, it gauged that there are reasonable life administrative work coordinating civilizations abroad to what people know in space. What's more, we most straightforward simply finding it, looking into the town lighting which can be found 7 trillion miles from Earth. NASA specialists can't resist the urge to ponder how long these lights have demonstrated in space anticipating individuals to become the gotten innovation to find them. David Kipping, a space expert from Columbia College, portrays the Proxima B exoplanet in which the town lighting have been seen as troublesome. He said so on the grounds that this large name machine closest to us has various warming styles that aren't similar as different planets. The ordinary rough planets are perceived to ingest daylight and radiate infrared radiation, Yet it is no more so for this exoplanet, as its infrared nature is really one of a sort from that of its have megastar named Proxima. This makes for a staggering assertion via the James Webb Space Telescope. JWST and the telescope came in reachable in light of the fact that the legitimate device for the assignment. The JWST is ready to stagger on infrared without any problem. Frequencies, the element warmth signature of Proxima B, will play a colossal capability in finding the common mysteries and strategies of its environmental elements. This may be a direct result of the present period of infrared abilities to image had through the JWST. Researchers anticipate utilizing the telescope to uncover the secrets it planets environmental to surround these conditions. They additionally objective to utilize the NET telescope to test the chances of harping on this exoplanet. The James Webb Telescope has an infrared responsiveness it really is expected to find what takes place at Proxima Center B Center of the late evening getting the slightest beams of light in the grandiose obscurity is frequently a contention for region telescopes, however no longer for the JWST as it could pick out even the smallest beams of light from region. It's the ideal gadget to confirm in the event that the gossipy tidbits about town lighting on Proxima B's night side are credible or bogus. Each fake enlightenment inside the universe might be detected by the telescope as lengthy on the grounds that it falls inside a recurrence band it is 1,000 times smaller than the starlight. How does Proxima Penny or B contrast with planet Earth? Proxima B has an absolutely exhilarating dating between its heavenly highlights and floor collaborations. The day side of the exoplanet comprises of numerous sunlight-based chargers that saddle the bubbly brilliant strength moved by method for via the VIP. Its spectra region also mirrors approaching light beams at the indistinguishable time. Proxima B finishes its circle around its host superstar, Proxima Center. It encounters constantly spans very much like what we have on Earth, with the sunshine getting high on sun-based warmth and the evening encountering coolness. The planet is remembered to have temperature changes not entirely settled through its peace. For example, if there is no climate on Proxima B, the contrast between its day and night lengths could be broad and far among. In the event that there might no direct effect of climatic gases in seas, the temperature of the day feature can be so hot like a dark body, and the evening side will terribly drop into cold darkness. 
the recognition of temperature rendition is an eminent trouble for stargazers to determine a more profound data of Proxima's climatic arrangement. Having an unmatched infrared imaging usefulness, the JWST can effectively look at the planet's warm outflows to offer canny records about its environmental houses. In all the circle of the James Webb Telescope around the Earth falls in arrangement with Proxima B's orbital period, mentioning total observable facts of its day and evening time stretches inside 11 Earth days. In view that it positively has a climate, the accompanying step can be to assess its climatic science to decide whether it might oblige ways of life. A few right tips in sorting out whether or not's way of life is right there, the presence of gases like oxygen, water vapor, and methane. In the event that those components would be able to be found on the Earth, it approach that it upholds reasonable circumstances. The cycle of practically sorting out this expects researchers to be fastidious adequate as they catch and concentrate on light beams that move through the planet's current circumstance. This is a very troublesome mission to take on, albeit the JWST has first-rate capacities for portraying planetary climates. It has an alternate significant objective. The telescope has been intended to, as it were, dissect the forms in water fume, carbon dioxide, and methane consideration with respect to recognizing fortified oxygen that is a basic sign of life. The JWST is obliged on this area. Even at that, the telescope by and by has substantial motivations to look for different elements in the world. Unquestionably, one of such thought processes is ozone, which offers away an exact degree of energy inside the air. It's too actually quite significant that the James Webb Region Telescope doesn't have outright abilities. What's more, it can peer at a couple of the nearest reasonable universes to Earth, conveying out a careful climatic examination. Stargazers are currently shifting towards ground fundamentally based observatories, very much like the incredibly huge telescope, Fly alluded to as ELT. The ELT is a telescope that has been planned to start working in 2028, and it's painstakingly situated to look further into the climatic construction of faraway exoplanets. It will create measurements on these arrangements, a decent approach to give total and lively knowledge into their degree of tenability. NASA researchers and all in various are luckily looking for the organization of fate region telescopes like these. Up to that point, anyway, the James Webb Space Telescope will remain a critical tool in our quest to uncover the secrets of remote exoplanets. No matter what its present-day obstacles, the James Webb Telescope has the potential to offer profound understanding that will reform our knowledge of exoplanetary exploration now and in the future. Researchers have a target for future space telescopes, and this is to reduce how much active light coming from a planet star, so that stargazers can basically see the lights considered from a planet itself. They plan to do this by using internal covers or large external satellites, which may be shaped like an umbrella, similar to using your hand to block out beams of sunlight to allow you to see a thing more clearly. In the bid to reduce the savage brilliance coming from the host VIP, future telescopes will be higher situated to examine faint impressions of light coming from exoplanets, considering a clear assessment of its environment and possibility of hosting life. Doing this comes with its own challenges, but researchers should recognize gases produced from life and those created from land processes, along with volcanic activity. Stargazers aren't yielding on their bid to recognize the attributes of exoplanets, so they might be more fit for finding signs of life and recognizing them from false positives. The JWST integrates a slew of scientific advancements from the exploration of exoplanets, giving a slip look into the wonderful discoveries we are yet to situate. As we stretch our knowledge and exploration of the universe increasingly far, we're better positioned to recognize the complex operations of the universe and our diverse roles in it. After looking through all the planets in space, researchers now can't seem to track down all in various that has presence. Regardless of numerous long stretches of searching through space for signs of life, the mission for sorts of presence on various planets keeps. Are we alone inside the universe? For several millions of years throughout human civilizations, people have always wondered whether they're the only ones abiding in the universe. That's a totally unique yearning that still hasn't left us in right now, even till today. Researchers have the James Webb Telescope in space, trying to detect extraterrestrial civilizations tucked away among us, even as they focus on a wide range of planetary bodies for signs of life. At the same time, the story that some extraterrestrial creatures are earnestly out there in the stars, just sitting tight for people to discover them, is indeed a popular story. To offer an answer to this question, 
two American space astronomers, Jill Tarter and Thomas Pearson, initiated a project known as the Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence in 1984, referred to as the SETI Foundation. Theirs is a philanthropic task that plans to sift through grandiose alarms to pick up best radio markers from space. Radio alarms can travel through extensive distances without getting dispersed or ingested like various types of radiation, hence their choice to focus on them. Radio transmissions are considerably more prone to be detected by utilizing the 42 radio telescopes that comprise the heavenly Allen Telescope cluster observed inside the fountain piles of California. However, the SETI Foundation has strictly observed signs and signs of these radio transmissions created with the aid of alien life. There have not been any such alarms for more than 30 years. Jill Tarter is optimistic that they may have a fabulous final product as they want to utilize the stuff of the 21st century to support up the journey. In the expressions of Jill, I need that you could empower Earthlings any place to come to be active individuals inside the last search for inestimable association. Are there some other techniques to become aware of alien life in outer space? Besides getting radio transmissions, there have been a couple of recently proposed considerations that life on different planets might be distinguished by their utilization of synthetic lighting apparatuses, just as we have in our cities on the planet. Stargazers ABI Throw and Edwin Turner made this idea. However, the practicality of the idea has been met with different requesting circumstances, and that means that space telescopes will have to zoom into individual stars in the universe to perceive if any of them contain an alien civilization. Researchers agree that alien civilizations most likely utilize synthetic lighting apparatuses to extend the daytime, so they can live proficiently for longer, similar to what we have on Earth. They suppose that a space telescope sensitive to these artificial lights may be able to effortlessly detect such alien towns. They additionally argue that superior aliens residing in exoplanets far away from their host stars would need to utilize large mirrors to collect light and direct it to their homes. If a telescope could be built to detect fake light produced by a sophisticated civilization, it could give researchers another fascinating method to discover intelligent extraterrestrial presence. NASA engineers believe that the James Webb Telescope is capable of coming across fake lighting. But it is worth raising that this telescope can attempt this if the light falls within 1,000 times smaller frequency band as compared to starlight. It is a confident conviction that future telescopes may be advanced to detect such signals better. Think about a future where in telescopes are advanced enough, besides as our investigation of space keeps up, with the quest for knowledge, the capacity for extraterrestrial life will turn out to be increasingly more complex. While contemporary advances very much like the James Webb Telescope provide valuable insights, they furthermore spotlight the limitations of our frontline methods. The quest for life beyond Earth stretches beyond simple detection. It involves interpreting complex air compositions, distinguishing between natural and synthetic anomalies, and refining our tools to better analyze distant worlds. In this pursuit, interdisciplinary collaboration is essential. Researchers across fields such as astronomy, biology, chemistry, and engineering merge to address the multi-layered challenges of astrobiology. Through pulling resources, data, and collaborative considerations, they push the limits of human capability and attempt to answer one of humanity's oldest questions. Are we alone in the universe? Besides, advancements in technology continue to hold the promise of disrupting our approach to extraterrestrial exploration. Future telescopes, space probes, and instrumentation may also have capabilities far beyond what we can currently imagine. From sensitive detectors capable of detecting weak signals to adaptive optic designs that mitigate atmospheric distortions, these tools will enable us to delve deeper into the universe with unprecedented clarity and precision. As we peer into the vast field of the universe, we remain poised on the limit of discovery. Each new discourse, each technological leap, gets us the direction of unraveling the secrets of distant worlds and uncovering the cosmic tapestry of existence. And while the search may be challenging, the potential rewards, insights into our place within the universe, and the discovery of extraterrestrial presence make it a journey worth pursuing with steadfast devotion.